Challenges that oil producing communities in the Niger Delta region faced over the years includes oil spills and the hazards of gas flaring. The negative impact is evident in the waterways, destroying economic activities in these communities and making life unbearable for the people. In the past, many Nigerians have called for the quick passage of the petroleum industry bill in order to address the impact of these environmental hazards on host communities. This is why the Senate Joint Committee on Petroleum Industry Bill is taking a tour around some of the affected host communities to assess the level of damage and degradation caused by oil spills and other oil extraction related environmental hazards. To help everything you can to help the people in Niger Delta, please pass the bill for us. The committee moves to the state capital on a courtesy call to the governor of Delta State, and then a stakeholders meeting to deliberate on the Petroleum Host Community Fund designated to improve the economics and social infrastructure of the communities within the petroleum producing areas. Please take our own. We want from production. Governor Ifanyo Ko at the meeting objected to different sections of the bill, proposing that it must encourage a good representation of the people's interest. As for the section 14 to be shall not read, the membership of the management committee shall comprise executive members selected by the board of trustees who shall be Nigerians of high integrity and professional standing from any of the sectors host and imparted of the it is not that we are going to pass the host community bill and leave the others. We are working on the three simultaneously and we hope to pass them at the same time. The PIB as it is today has been split into four parts by the National Assembly as follows. The Petroleum Industry Governance Bill, the Host Communities Fiscal Reforms and Administration Bill, whilst the Governance Bill has been passed, the other three are at different levels of review.